Hello loves, I want to thank you so much for coming back to my channel today. If today is your first time, I do want to welcome you. On today's episode, we'll be making my scrumptious fried rice recipe. This recipe is so simple, it can be done in 5 minutes. If you are interested in learning how to make this recipe, please stay tuned and I'll take it step by step. Let me go ahead and quickly go through the ingredients which we'll be using. I have diced my green peppers, my onions, I have grated some ginger, I've also diced some jalapenos. I will be using this imitated crab um, meat. I'm using my diced or chopped carrots. I'll be using this oyster sauce and this stir fry sauce as well. Also, we are going to need our rice. I've already cooked it. And finally, we need our oil. So please stay tuned. Once again, I do want to thank you so much for coming by today. Should you have any questions, please do not hesitate to leave it down below for me and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. I want to thank you so much for staying tuned. May God bless you. Remember, life without Jesus Christ is lifeless. Please stay tuned. God bless you and bye-bye. Till next time, see you then. So the first thing we need to do is to go ahead and pour about two tablespoons of our oil and I'm using olive oil. I do not want my onions to get soggy. So what I'm going to cook first is the carrots. It's a bit hotter than the onions. Let's just give it a simple stir. Let's allow it to cook a little bit and then we'll come in and pour our additional ingredients. Okay, so at this time we can go ahead and add our fresh ginger, our grated ginger. Whatever trusted seasoning that you have, you can use it. I'm using this seasoning stock here and a little bit of my powdered chicken bouillon season. And of course the um, seasoning and salt should be to your taste. Now we can go ahead and add our jalapenos. Give that a stir as well. Doesn't it look beautiful? Look at how colorful it is. <laughs> okay, let's leave it a little bit to cook. Then we'll come back. Now we can go ahead and add our chopped or diced green peppers. Give that a stir as well. As you can see, this recipe is super, super simple to make. Okay, let's leave it to cook for about maybe So finally, minutes. let's go ahead and add our chopped onions. And give that a stir. At this point, we can also add our crab meat. Mm. 
let's also add our sauces now I'm using my stir fry sauce and now the oyster sauce Let's give it a stir. Mix it completely with the vegetables. If you want your fried rice to be brownish, you will need your soy sauce. I did not introduce it when I was doing the introduction about the, um, the ingredients. But if you want it to be brown, you can add a little bit of soy sauce. Now let's add our rice. Some people don't use the soy sauce because they are completely satisfied with the oyster sauce or whatever um, sauce they choose to use. It's optional. Let's give that a stir. I'll go ahead and add all the um, the remaining rice and then come and show you the final result. Please stay tuned as I do that. Okay, so um, the fried rice is all coming together and it's almost done. So you can reduce your heat. I'm just going to add a little bit of the soy sauce. And then give it a stir. Please leave me comments down below if you did give this recipe a try and let me know how it went okay <laughs> I would love to know Okay, let's give it like three more minutes and it will be done. Hello okay. everyone, so our fried rice is ready. Once again, I do want to thank you so much for staying tuned and learning how to make my simple um, fried rice recipe. Um, please leave a comment down below if you should have one. I appreciate you staying tuned. Till next time, God bless you and bye-bye.